Hello and welcome to Dozen Houston County Library System's Crafter Noon Tea. Today we're doing paper flower frames. So you have your frame and you have these paper flower stencils here that we're going to cut out like so. Okay, make sure you cut into it. And then we're going to put them together. So cut out all your tiny little pieces like that. Okay, the little ones too. And you want to poke holes in each of the pieces using a needle or some of the niftier um, scrapbooking tools. And I kind of wiggled it around to get it a little bit bigger because the brads, these things here, are not circles, they're flat and they're really hard to get through the paper. What you want to do is take your little flower piece and your brad and stick the brad through that little piece first. Which is kind of hard, but it will go. There we go. See? And then we start with one of our sides. Okay, we're going to fold it over just a little bit and take the next one and then just keep going around the flower. one can get a touch awkward especially on the little bitty ones but it will work we have put them all together okay and once you finish with the petals stick it through the back and bend your brad to make it close just like that okay and once you've done all of your flowers that you want to use decide how you want it to sit up if you want it to go long ways or sideways, you want it to be at the top though, so you could do it all across the top or however. Okay, and then take your hot glue gun. You will need that for this one. Or you can use the sticky foam, which can be found in the scrapbooking section. Um, of Michael's or Hobby Lobby or anything like that. Let's just put a little dollop on each. And there you go. You now have a frame. Be sure to remove the film from your plastic as well when you go to put your picture in. There you go. From your library team.